Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're going to learn about operations with complex numbers. And this is a critical thinking question. We're going to ask ourselves here, how are the following problems different? And we need to simplify each one to determine that. So, if I was given these two problems, and I'll write them separately, 2 plus x minus 3 minus 2x. And the other problem is 2 plus i minus 3 minus 2 i. So you can see these two problems are pretty much exactly the same, except one has the variable x and the other one has the letter i, i meaning an imaginary number. So let's go simplify each one individually and see if there's anything different here. Well, first thing, I need to distribute that minus sign into the parentheses. So we have 2 plus x here. That becomes a minus 3, and then Subtracting a negative 2x is adding a positive 2x. At this point, I want to combine my like terms. 2 and negative 3 come together to be a negative 1, and then the x and 2x come together to be a 3x, leaving me with a negative 1 plus 3x as my final answer for this one. Let's do the same thing with the imaginary. Same rules, really. We have to distribute this minus sign first. So by doing that, let's rewrite the 2 plus i, distributing the minus 3, so the minus to the 3, minus 3 now, and minus to the minus 2i is a positive 2i. At this point, we want to combine our like numbers. 2 and a negative 3 is a negative 1, and i and 2i are 3i. In this case, as far as our steps, we simplify both all the way, and there is nothing different. The only difference really being this is a variable, and this is an imaginary number. But other than that, all the steps were exactly the same. So let's recap. We're, in it, we're given... Um, 2 plus x minus 3 minus 2x, and 2 plus i minus 3 minus 2i. Essentially, two, exact, uh, two problems that are exactly the same, one with a variable, one with an imaginary number. We were asked to simplify and determine if there's any difference there. We determined there wasn't, and they came out to be, what, the same, right? But let's go through that again. We simplified both. We distributed the subtraction sign to both parts. We did that here. And that was exactly the same. From there, we combined our like terms and like numbers. 2 and minus 3 became a negative 1, right there and here. And x and 2x became 3x, and here i and 2i became a positive 3i. At this point, there's nothing else that we can do to simplify, and we see that the steps were exactly the same for both of the left and the right one. And our final answer was pretty much the same. Again, the difference being this has a variable that has an imaginary number. So again, our final answer here is these are really the same. The same steps, at least.